Hello everybody, today we gotta make a fry sage leaves. For the ingredient we gotta beer, flour, salt and black pepper. Still I gotta go to my garden to pick it up the sage leaves. And look how beautiful sage I got over here. And this is the leaves, I pick it up the big one. And we start the curl with the seed. Make sure you have a little stick over here, like this one you fry you. I pick it up the sage, but I pour in the cold water. Plus, I pour ice inside, like this, the sage it come really, really nice. After I take it out, I dry with the paper towel. Everything and not look a beautiful look. It's really, really dry. And I use grape seed oil. It gets really good to the fry. And I got it right on the stove and the pots. And I put the gas on and low. Now we got to make the butter for the sage of the fry. And for start, we need the beer. Beer. And I got to put over here, but I like to put over here, but too bad, you got to use over here. And we use almost all the beer, but it got a little bit. Ah, really good. Now, for start of this, I use the flour. In Italy, we call pastella. And we put the, bit, the flour a little bit at a time. Kind of want to be like cavatelli. Oh, look how beautiful the beer for wow. a But now, I was using one beer. So I need more flour. No worry about it. I got a lot of flour. Now, this is not going to be too thick. The barrel. Barrel, right? I did it good. I speak English. No. I think we got to use more flour. Okay, now this, you see, it got to be like that. Okay, okay you don't want it too much. Because you put it too much, after it come like more flour. And you know what? You want to see the sage nice. Okay, and now we need a little salt. A little black pepper. Okay, and we give a good mix. Okay, this is good. And now we gotta go on the stove. And we gotta make sure the oil is hot. And we gotta start to fry the sage. Okay, now let me check my oil with the stick. This is my thing, I, I look. You see, start the bubble. And the oil, it's ready for me. I want to start with the six, do not put too many. And I put this, and now you dip over here like this. And you, and you fry. Look at how easy it is. This is really easy. It's so easy to eat too. Okay, now we can start the turn. As he got to fry more, we turn the other way again. All right. We leave a fry like this. Look how beautiful it look. This, uh, it's so crunchy. After what you eat this, it with a nice cold beer. Oh, so good. Okay, now we turn one time more. You see? It's a beautiful color. All right. Now, we put on a paper towel. Like this, you take all the little oil out. And we take one by one. It look really crunchy. And I do the rest, the same thing like I did this one. Now this is done, nice fry, nice color, crispy. And we need a little sea salt on the top. And this salt is so good. And now it's a test. But, don't forget my beer. And look at this now. Mm. 
nice and crunchy. Mmm. Delicious. A nice cold beer. Really, really good. Mmm. Look at that. Now, this, for me, it's much better than potato chips. Delicious. And this is no expense. You go in the garden and you fry. The potato chips you gotta buy. Ginger. Salad. And we see you next time. Ginger.